Hi, my name is Jason Buck. I work with Remax Estate Properties and I shoot a lot of video of homes coming onto the market in the real estate area here in Palos Verdes. This way you get a first-hand look of what a property looks like and you can decide, maybe I need to change my schedule to get over here and see this. Um, basically, we're suffering from a lack of inventory. With that means that prices are still staying high and homes are selling pretty quickly because there's just not enough homes to satisfy the demand. So. Barkentine is a beautiful street. Uh, Palos Verdes Drive West is right up that way. Uh, the Portuguese Bend Land Preserve is up on the other side of the street. There's miles of hiking trails. And this community has its own private path to take you down to the rocky shore here at Abalone Cove. It's not really a beach, but there's rocks and there's trails and it's nice to have that private access. So let's take a look at this place, 14. Uh, the driveway goes down to the back, garages in the back, uh, like the brick, patio coming up this is a nice beautiful place to kick back on your front porch you get a little ocean view here in fact that's Catalina and the Isthmus there so that's cool to see that stepping in here's our entrance pretty cool construction uh, you got the exposed beams and you have a beautiful oak hardwood floor they call that peg and groove with the pegs and the grooves and it puts you into this nice light and bright living room with all the windows. It's really cool. And the dining section here. Looking back, you know, it's a nice setup. I haven't turned any lights on, so this is uh, bright for this area. And look at the kitchen. Good setup. So could use some upgrades, but for the most part, it's uh, totally livable and great, great uh, space. Pantry. Half bath here, and then your living room. Nice setup. Let's go to the other side here. This would be the master. So nice big doors going to the outside, and big patio, good size room, double closets here and over here, and then a three-quarter bath. Some showers over there. This is a great area. It's easy access and a nice spot. Easy access to both the shops and getting on and off the hill and so forth. So that was one and then you have two here. So they got double beds in this one. Original bath. But this has both a tub and a shower. And then bedroom number three, good size room here. And the windows are pretty. I mean, it's just done well. It's all smooth ceilings, crown molding. This takes you back to that living room in front. So then this could be maybe family room. Hard to say which one's which. And then you got a pretty good size yard and pool. So a lot of patio stuff out here and over this way. So probably pretty easy to expand this house if you wanted to make this would be the master and it comes out this way. Um, and you still got a pretty good sized pool and yard. So fruit tree. Let's take a look at the garage. You know, they've created a lot of new rules for what they call accessory dwelling units. So you could make the garage uh, a living space and be a rental um, in which case you have a private access down the driveway right to this so it's an option so pretty darn good spot roof looks to be in good condition you know i i like it um if you got questions about the area i want to know what the prices are going for give me a call i'm happy to help out and uh, happy to show you this place if you want to come get a closer look so Thanks a lot for watching. Make it a great day.